they're here. Okay, everyone, you get the idea. But on a serious note, this is part of how everyone treats the Gugan Bits. Right? So, before we jump into today's video, if this is your first time on the channel, my name is Tyler, and I do a lot of fishing on the Harris Chain in Florida. So, if you would like to keep up with me and all my fishing adventures, please consider subscribing. And also, if you are subscribed, make sure you turn on your post notifications. That way, you get notified every time I upload a video. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, drop a comment down below. Let me know what you would want to see me do on a future video. With that being said, let's jump into today's video. So, I know a lot of you guys have probably heard of Googan Baits. They are all over YouTube. The Googan Squad, they've been doing so many videos about their baits. So, if you have no idea what Googan Baits are, why, why are you even watching this video? Anyway, like my shirt, I made this special shirt for you guys. Hang on, let me grab it. So, I made this shirt for you guys. The Googan Squad shirt. Limited edition, only by me, Googan Squad. Now, I know... I know this is really similar to the other shirt that you've seen that the Good Skull wears, and I decided I was going to make this for you guys to order. There's only one in stock right now. Okay, seriously, guys, this is a joke, okay? This is, that is a joke. I'm just kidding. If you would like to actually buy a actual Guggen Squad shirt from the Guggen Squad, there's a link in the top of the description. You can buy their baits, you can buy their merchandise, anything the Guggen Squad sells, there's a link in the top of the description to their website, and I, that was just a joke, okay, I'm seriously not, I'm not doing that, though. anyway, I know you guys would love to see what the Guggen Baits look like underwater, so, let's jump into the first clip, and the first clip we have for you guys is of the Kraken Crawl, ready, here it comes, okay guys, I'm going to be doing a narration for you while you're watching this video, and the first bait we have is the Kraken Crawl, black with blue flag, and I ordered the color because on the Harris Chain it's really dirty water, and overall this bait would be great for flipping, and also what I'd love to throw it on is a Carolina rig. This would be great for a Carolina rig on like a ledge or something, but sadly there's not a whole lot of ledges on the Harris Chain, but yeah, that this would be a great bait for a Carolina rig, but I have it rigged up now, a Texas rig, with a three out hook and a eight, a three, I'm sorry, a three eighths ounce weight. Yes, that's what I have it on and with a bobber stopper, of course. And I like how the tails are moving, like the action with the tails, it's just so different than any of the baits I've seen. It's just the way they designed them, they wanted them to have like more action in the tails. Yeah, and there's a slow motion of it, the tails moving, which is really, really nice. And you can swim this bait uh, I was like popping it a lot and flipping. Flipping would be great, just like for that thing just to land straight down in front of the bass, like they would just destroy that. And they always go on about like the Guggen Bait Company, they are all about like the smell of their baits. And I personally, I, I smelled, like when I first got these baits, I smelled these baits and I was like, I was like, hmm, that's different. It smelled like to me, it smelled like licorice. Just that's the smell, and there's a little slow motion right there, that's, that's cool, just look at how it's falling like that, that's nice, okay, anyway, the smell was licorice, and I don't know, I, I'm pretty sure I've, like, for something that, like, really stinks, like, a lot of baits and, like, like, scents and stuff you can spray, or, like, you know, those KBD sticks you just, like, uh, like, lip balm and you put on your baits, those smell so bad, if you get that on your hands, it's gonna, like, stink the rest of the day your hands are gonna smell so bad so i think what these guys did is they put in the scent for these baits and after they did that they added something else to make it smell better that way when like when we smelled it or if it got on our hands we just smell like kind of like a licorice smell i mean i'm not sure if that's what they were going for but i'm just guessing here but that i mean look at the bait from like from looking straight up on it it looks really good so yeah, that's that's what I think of the Kraken Crawl. I think it's really, really good. I can't wait to flip this bait. So let's move on to the Trench Hog. So this next bait we have is the Trench Hog. And the color I ordered this in is Blue Baby. And 
I ordered this color because I, when I saw this bait, I was thinking, I'm definitely going to be swimming this bait. I'd say the way to probably throw this, I'd probably say Texas rigged, Carolina rig, and swimming it through the water. And even during the spawn, this would probably be really good. And also, like, when like they're eating bluegill, this would also be a good looking bait for bluegill. You could probably put a little orange in there, and that would look awesome. So I bought this bait to swim it when the fish are starting to move offshore and then move up during like the spawn so for florida that'd probably be like uh i'd say like towards the end probably january through maybe march maybe in between there for the spawn in florida that's probably when i'd be throwing this bait a lot and also i would not say to flip this bait if you ask me like tyler should i flip this bait no, I mean, yeah, Texas rig, yes, you can flip this bait with like a lightweight, but if you mean like flip it into heavy mats with a half ounce to an ounce weight, I'd say definitely not because the tails, they'll most likely rip off. I mean, I'm not saying they're going to rip off, but I'm going to say like most likely if you throw it in the heavy cover and you just keep pitching it and pitching it and pitching it into like really heavy mats and just sending it straight through there, it's probably going to rip these tails off because they're really thin tails on this bait. So I'd not say, I would not say flip this bait. Also, I'd probably like throw this into maybe offshore grass and slowly pull it through the grass and probably swim it through the grass. This would probably be a really good bait for like offshore fishing. And probably like, I'd say fishing cover and docks also, maybe. I don't know, it's just you can do a lot with this bait and look at all those little appendages. That, that bait looks awesome. So I'm pretty sure Flair helped design this bait. So shout out to flair because he did a great job i really like this bait and i'm going to be getting some more guggen baits so if i get enough likes on this video enough support i will do another video just like this one if you guys like it so thank you so much i'm gonna yeah that looks that looks awesome so i just by the way there is a link in the top of the description you can order these baits I definitely suggest ordering these baits because i was ordering them just to try them because i was hearing so much like there's so much hype around these baits, like people are getting so excited. So thank you guys so much for watching and let's go into the outro. Well, that is all I have for today's video. I want to give a huge shout out to the entire Goon Squad and everyone else who have made these baits possible. They're really good quality baits. And I've been watching the Goon Squad and all of the Googans for quite a while now. And I've really enjoyed their videos. And I'm trying to do the same so that maybe one day I can do what I love for a living. And this is my passion. I love to fish. I've been fishing for so long now and I really enjoy it, so I'm so glad I can show you guys these videos. So please consider subscribing, it really helps me. I wanna thank each and every one of you for subscribing to my channel, and also for you guys who have smashed the like button, thank you guys so much. And I wanna thank you guys for so much support you've given me throughout these last five months. I've only been doing YouTube for five months, so I wanna thank you guys so much. It's been such a blessing to be able to do this. So I thank you guys so much, and as always, I will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please consider subscribing now you don't miss out on any of my new videos in the future. If you would like to see another video like this in the future, please smash that like button. If I get enough likes, I will do another video just like this. If you would like to watch some of my other videos, click right over there. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, click right over there. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next week.